well hi so what if i start the today's video of creating a whatsapp campaign with a question to you like and the question is where do you show the ads when you launch a whatsapp campaign because people think that whatsapp campaign is going to show the ads on whatsapp app <laughs> even though if i talk about the platforms availability in meta it's all about showing the ads on facebook showing the ads on instagram showing the ads on messenger and lastly showing the ads at different audience networks of Facebook, which means Facebook app partners. So what's the meaning of the WhatsApp campaign? This is a question for you. But before I get into answering this question, let me show you the performance of what all we have launched. Now, if I just show you the today's performance for this account, where we started with launching awareness campaign, it has generated 14,000 reaches. But then let me switch this window from today to maximize which means now we are looking at the data for the entire duration so in total in this account we have spent 1086 rupees this is something which you get in the amount spent column so we started with the awareness campaign a campaign with the objective of getting reach and it took us to around 1 lakh people 95000 people to be precise only after spending 121 rupees then we launched a traffic campaign for Facebook, in fact, for all the platforms, which has generated 44 landing page views. So 44 people have seen the website and we only spend 183 rupees for this campaign. We also launched a page like campaign, the Facebook page like campaign. I shall be naming it FB page like campaign. And it has generated 31 page likes on Facebook. After spending 254 rupees, the cost per like was around 8.24. We also launched a profile visit campaign on Instagram with the objective of getting 82 profile visitors. And yesterday we launched this post post campaign with the objective of getting engagement on a post. We only spent 15 rupees and generated 25 post engagements. Now, tell me which campaign has not performed at all in all of these six campaigns. So if you are thinking about the product catalog campaign, then that's the right campaign. This is something which has not performed at all, even after spending 368.96 rupees. So we have almost spent around 400 rupees on this campaign. And yet we have not received even one single purchase. It's really concerning. It's really annoying, really bothering. But then we have to wait for a while. Let's spend some more amount on this campaign. And then this will start generating some sales in fact you become a performance marketer when you start generating sales from these campaigns otherwise you are just a digital marketer so if you can't generate performance from a campaign you don't become an expert you don't become a performance expert or performance marketer is the term that we use in digital marketing industry maybe you know how to launch all of the campaigns but then you get valuable asset for any company when you can perform the campaign optimization leads to the performance of the campaign this is where you have to think about this is where it really changes you from an from a marketer from a digital expert to a performance driver anyways now let's quickly get back into the today's topic which is all about whatsapp campaign so i asked you where the hell you show the ads when you launch whatsapp campaign so basically this campaign shows the ad only and only on these platforms. But the reason why I name it or why we call it a WhatsApp campaign is because when somebody see ads on these platforms and they click on the ad copy, the person lands on WhatsApp Messenger. So the ad is going to show up on Facebook, Instagram Messenger or on your team's network. But then person will land on WhatsApp. I know you must be thinking how the hell the ad is going to perform. How the hell we gonna we going to create the ad copy. So let's quickly get into creating the campaign but before i do so let me tell you what all we have to do so first of all we have to choose the campaign objective and the campaign type which is the level one of meta ads we call it campaign level once the campaign level is decided once the campaign objective is selected we have to get into the level two where we decide everything this is the place where we decide the daily budget target location target gender age range interest and behavior of audience we also decide the target platform and eventually we decide the devices if you want to show the ads to mobiles or desktops 
Additionally, you have an option to show the ads to a particular device, a particular model of the devices. Let's say you want to show the ads to people who are using Samsung S24. If you have a product which is, let's say, Samsung S24 mobile cover, then you choose Samsung S24 in the device. You show the ads only to people who are using Wi-Fi somewhere sitting in their homes or maybe offices. And then once the level two is completed, finally we have to get into the level three, which is the ads level. This is the level where you choose the campaign creative, video, or number of creatives, which is called as carousels. So I hope now we know a lot of things about the campaign, about the levels. Let's quickly jump in the account to create the campaign by clicking on this create button. So we have to go with engagement objective, click on continue, choose the manual setup, click on continue again, and then we get into the level one to name the campaign. Let's say we name it is spring tails underscore WhatsApp campaign. WhatsApp campaign, perfect. You don't have to do anything else in the campaign settings. We click on next and we reach to the level two, which is at set level here we have to go with the conversion location, which is going to be WhatsApp app in our case. So here we're going to convert within Messenger, WhatsApp or Instagram. So because it's going to be a WhatsApp campaign, we uncheck the option of Messenger or Instagram. These are these could be the other two messaging option that we have in the messaging campaigns. Choosing WhatsApp will ask us to connect a phone number, which we can simply connect by clicking on this button. And then we have to decide the performance goal. For us, it's the number of conversions in terms of generating messages. You can read this line. And then we have to decide the daily budget. For us, it could be 100 INR a day for now. We can set up a start or end date. And finally, it's time to decide the location. So for here, we can choose Delhi. And we can proceed further to choose the target age range. And interest and these things are available in this audience suggestion optional so we have to decide the age range from here let's say we go with 18 till 34 and the reason why we are going with 18 to 34 and also targeting women is because this campaign is gonna target products or project which is springtails an artificial jewelry store for women that's why we are going with women and that's why the ads are being shown to a lesser age range in terms of placement, we can of course go with the default options where the ads are going to be shown to all four placements or else we can decide going with Facebook, Instagram, Messenger or audience network. And finally, we can choose the devices somewhere from here to show the ads to all the devices or maybe to iOS users only. Finally, we also get options to choose a particular device, something like iPhone 5S something like Samsung S24. We just, we just have to enter the model name. And then we also have this option of showing the ads to more Wi-Fi users. So these targetings could be really detailed. And depending on these targetings, you make the campaign perform. But right now we are just going with all default options. So we go with advantage displacement, we click on next, which takes us to the final level of this campaign, which is ad level ad name then we have to choose the image or the carousel we have to add a media so you click on this add media button click on add image and you upload an image from the instagram maybe from the account so we already have this image added to the account we can simply go with choosing this image click on done and towards the right we get the ad preview it says chat with us on whatsapp on this number and we have this WhatsApp button. So now you can simply see the ad is going to be visible within Facebook and Instagram. To see more preview, we can click on this advanced preview button and the ad is going to be visible in these formats. On Facebook feed, something like this. On Insta feed, something like this. On Insta story, something like this. And everywhere we have this chat on WhatsApp button. When somebody clicks on this chat on WhatsApp button, a person is going to land in the WhatsApp app. Then we click on save. We scroll down. If you want to change the headline, the description, we can do it from here. And then we can finally launch this campaign by clicking on the publish button. So it was that simple. You didn't really have to think much about launching the campaign if you know the setup of the campaign already. Now, people who are looking forward to become an expert for this WhatsApp campaign, 
I want you to do a couple of exercises. If you have already joined the training sheet, if you have already uh, a member of this training, then you can quickly jump into this row 15 where you start with creating an image or a banner on Canva as exercise one. Then you create a WhatsApp campaign as exercise two. And finally, we will look into optimizing this campaign. There are a lot of things that we have to understand while it, when it comes to campaign optimization. But right now, I want you to do these two exercises. If you have not completed the other exercises already, which is defined for each and every campaign, then you first complete the exercises for the previous campaigns. Then I shall be seeing you in the next video where we discuss about what results we are getting from this WhatsApp campaign. We shall be getting some results over here and how much cost we are generating the messages. We'll also look into what kind of people are connecting over WhatsApp. I shall be seeing you in the next video. You will find that link of this training sheet somewhere in the description of this video. I will see you then.